try this again. <laughs> this is part two of week 36 and 37 pregnancy vlog. I went to get up to show you guys my belly and it cut off because as you all know, if you've watched me for years, I'm a talker. So this, um, like I says, 36, 37 weeks, I wanted to say without being rushed, congratulations to um, Callista and Peter. She is Mrs. Godfrey 08. They had baby Anna and she's beautiful. And my husband woke me up from my nap and said that Alana, he read on her Facebook that her water broke and that she was being induced when? More morning. Like, I guess half of her water broke or something like that. And they're going to finish, finish it by inducing her tomorrow morning if she doesn't progress is what, how I'm getting it from my husband. I haven't been on Facebook to see, but go yeah. congratulate her. And we are praying, Alana, that everything will be fine. Everything will be fine, girl. You'll do great. And to be honest with you, I'm getting a little nervous. <laughs> Alana was due six days before me. Callista was due a day before me and my friends are having their babies. And so next I'll be watching for you, Renee, when you're going to be having your baby. So anyhow, kind of getting nervous. We have how many days, Alan? 26 days until my due date. Um, by her weight and by my last ultrasound, I'm 25. oh 25 days. By my weight and my ultrasound, I'm 37 weeks today. By my due date, I'm 37 weeks this coming Wednesday. So anyhow, I'm getting I'm getting excited, but I want her to stay there. I want her to stay there as long as she needs to be there. I'm not in any hurry to have her. I would love to see her, love to meet her. I feel like I already have a connection with her. She definitely lets me know she's present. And um, I haven't showed any naked belly shots because she gets real shy when my husband pulls out the cameras, which is very odd for her because she's moving all the time. And we've gotten some, but not the really good movements. I wish I would have really got the good, good movements Friday morning because oh, she's moved like that before. But to actually stare at my belly and watch her move like that was just, it was neat. She's kicking me right now as we as we talk. So I'm gonna show my belly. Alan, is it okay if I share a bare, bare belly? Okay, I just want to check with my husband at this point. Um, I want to let you guys know I don't see a lot of extra skin up at the top, but I do definitely see extra skin at the bottom. I, my husband, my parents, my surgeon, my doctor. None of them believe that that skin's going to fill, be filled out even when I drop, even though some people say that it looks like I've dropped already. Since I've showed you guys my belly, I don't remember last time I showed you guys, I definitely have gotten bigger. Um, I've got the waddle, everyone says. They say my ass has gotten huge and my hips and my breast and I don't know. <laughs> so much stuff's happened with my body since I've been 18 that I just don't keep up anymore. I, I just know that she's inside me. I feel her. She definitely responds to men's voices. If I'm around my husband and he's talking a lot or my dad or a man on TV that has a darker, deeper voice, darker, deeper voice, she responds. She really starts moving. Um, when Alan specifically talks to her and pay attention to my belly, she really moves. When I have to coach him or cue him to do it, she's not interested. Did you hear him? <laughs> So I'm going to let him share just a couple thoughts with you guys on how he's feeling. About what? About how close we are. Is that you? Yeah, it's me. Okay, I can't see you. A big old fat head. Oh, you have a big old. How are you feeling since your surgery? Getting better. About 50% better. Tell him what kind of surgery you had. Shoulder surgery. And you're off work for how long? Two weeks. Three weeks altogether. I sleep a lot. And what's Christy been doing? Can't keep her ass down. What's she been doing? Laundry. She's almost all already done. Because she won't sit still long enough to do anything else. What am I doing? What do you think I'm doing? Well, I don't know. 
nesting. Is that all you wanted to say? Yeah, that's all I want to say. You didn't want to say nothing about your baby girl? Well, she can't wait to see her, but she's seen her. She's seen her as long as she can. Yeah, that's how I feel too. Alright, so I gotta get up and get this pregnancy belly shown to you guys. <sighs> okay, so here I am. See, I'm about to do. <laughs> here I am, 36, 37, start of 37 weeks. Front. Side. I gotta move back a little bit. My camera's not big enough to get me. Okay. Okay, see, this is where I have the line where my pants always sat and I had a, you know. But if I move the extra skin up, that's her. It's not like I had to pick it up last time where, but yeah, there it is front. And my belly button is, do you guys see right here? That's all extra skin from the massive weight loss. I had lost over 200 pounds and it's just extra skin that will never get filled out. But she's clear down here. For my belly button, when I do that, when I pick up that extra skin, my belly button's almost completely flat. It's right, I mean, right there. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, look at all my old, these are all, I've not gotten any new stretch marks. These are all old from being big, but you guys want me to get close to the camera. Anyways, but that's me without lifting up extra skin. That's me. All right, it looks better with clothes. <laughs> Not the most prettiest pregnant belly, but I definitely, I think I'm showing pregnancy and not so much fat anymore. But I do miss the, the weight I had lost, but she's so worth it. So, anyhow. There you be, 36, 37 weeks. I think I'm going to make it to, even though I'm considered full term now, I think I'll make it to my 40 weeks, if not over. So I do not want to be induced for anything. I just, I want her to come on her own. I want to try naturally as possible. Speaking of natural, look at this natural blonde. It looks brown. This is all my natural hair color, right here. And then out here, where it's really white, that's all dyed light blonde but it's like a strawberry blonde I haven't seen my natural hair color in years and my husband wants me to grow it out he doesn't want me to dye it anymore because he said he really likes it but it's blonde it's just darker anyways I'll stop talking oh, I'm, I'm getting excited and nervous and I'll just I'm gonna leave this video by saying I'm scared I am you guys are gonna tell me not to be scared but I am I'm gonna be responsible for this little tiny baby girl and I know I adopted Spencer when he was three and a half and and I know I'll do okay but I'm just I'm nervous so I guess it's just part of the whole pregnancy thing but excited as well so we will talk with you guys later bye